We are Arcade Rising and we're at Erie, Pennsylvania round one and it's time for a prize battle. So today we're doing a prize battle. In the prize battle, it's me versus Erica, and we each get 25 plays to see who can build the toughest, meanest, awesomest battle group. And then at the end of the video, we compare them head to head. Does a bear beat a tiger? Does a cat beat a bunny? We'll leave that up to you at the end. So let's go build our battle groups and see who's gonna win. So Erica is up first, but I'm, I just wanna make sure that you understand the rules. Your win, your wins, your prizes, your plush go up against mine. Yeah. And you're still comfortable going for a minion. Yes. I mean, minions tend, tend to mess things up, cause problems, hijinks, yes, if you will, hygiene. shenanigans. Set traps for all of your little creatures. Ooh, that was medium. Yeah, I'll try one more. Yeah, we don't want to waste too many plays on one machine unless you're really committed. Oh, oh my. Man. I mean, it, it depends on how many you want to try for. It, it doesn't look weak. Three. For a Gemini, it's doing well. Hold on to it. Don't you drop it. Hold oh, on. Hold on. Oh, my goodness. Oh, and it landed wonky, though. Yeah, wonky. Oh, should I go again? I would go again. I'm not trying to ruin your plays. This is number four, but... But that held on really good. And being close to the chute, now your only problem is it kind of set up all wonky-like. Yeah. So it may have to get knocked down first. Oh, see? But it's better now. So here's play number right. five. You're going all in on this uh, minion. This will be my last play on him, so. Oh yeah. man, if we were playing normally, I would say keep going, keep going. but that's five <laughs> plays and it may take 10. So let's go see what I can find. All right, so what's your first pick? I'm going for a dog. I don't know what kind of dog it is, but it's, it's a mean looking dog, at least compared to that minion you went for. So my strategy, I'm gonna try each side first and see how they do. And then if one looks robust enough, I'll focus on that side. Ooh, I went with the crab pinch apparently. I did not like that. So my strategy is to guide you towards machines that aren't gonna win, and then I just need to win like one minifigure and I'm, I'm the victim. <laughs> All right, I hope this plays a lot better than that one does. That did look better. Nope. Oh, okay, I'm gonna give one more play on that. I almost feel like I wanna obligate five plays to this since you did, but I just don't trust the Geminis. Okay, oh, I'll tell you what, I'm, I'm backing off. I'm gonna take my three and leave. So I know what you're thinking. This has no battle power whatsoever. It's a pineapple seal. Oh, but my. it does have a special power where it squirts fruit juice into the eyes of its enemies. <laughs> Or it's a good snack for one of mine. Well, I don't think minions eat pineapple, so. <laughs> yeah, they do. But it is Gemini again. So we'll see how it goes. I gotta, I might have to dig it off the side here. Ooh. I'll give that one more play. Now I will say, sometimes when you sque squeeze a fruit, you don't know where the juice is going. So can hit my knee in the eye too. Exactly. It's a risk I'm willing to take. Oh man, these Geminis today look like they want to grab, but we're not having any luck. So let's go see what other battle prizes we can find. Not that I have any room to talk since I went for a pineapple, but a squishy cat. <laughs> so you can claw your eyeballs. It is, it is a nice plush. I love the cream and orange, but you know what? I would be a hypocrite if I said it just doesn't look like a battle pet, because I went for a pineapple seal. Exactly. Now these tend to be wide, so I would recommend not wasting too many plays if it does not go around. Oh, you stabbed. Oh, that was two claws, so you might have some luck here. All right, now remember, it, does, it didn't spin that time. 
Oh, much better. Dang, that's a death grip. Uh oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's doing what I'm doing, pointing my booty at you. Her third play on this machine. I'm not sure about this one. Now, this could slide it over the edge of the chute, which would be good. Oh, it um, didn't move it. It didn't move it. I mean, you're looking at at least two more plays. What do you think? I think I'm gonna switch up and go to All something right. else. That's what I would do. Let's go see what we got. A bear dressed as a frog on a pusher. So here's the thing. She was walking by looking for stuff. I saw this one. I think it's very winnable and I didn't say anything. I'm like, walk past it. <laughs> and then she, she goes three down, stops, turns around, and goes after my prize. <laughs> yes, now, I did. There is a chance it's stuck, but I, I think it's okay. I hope it's stuck since you're, you're playing it, but whatever. Wow, that didn't move at all. Uh -uh. Seriously? Oh, the button stuck. <laughs> okay, I was watching, and we do know there's a machine that the button sticks, so unless you, we're not gonna count this one. All right, we didn't count that last play. It was the machine. This would be play number nine. She's going for a, a boba cat. Yeah. She said it was a boba tiger, but it's a cat. All right, she's going for the base. Oh, yeah, yeah, you just slid right down I the side. off the side. <laughs> it is turn number six, and I'm going for... The same thing I just went for. I've decided you were right. It's a tiger. <laughs> when you were playing, it was a tabby. I'm going to try to catch the brim of the boba. Oh, I did the same thing. It slid even off the brim. This may have been a bad choice. So <laughs> that was play number six. More of a plush hit. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> to, to knock it off, I'd have to hit. You know what? I'm going to try one more time. Okay. So this will be play number eight. I'm aiming for the base. Where the plush meets the... And see if I can't dislodge it right there. Oh, it kind of did. This might be dumb, but I'm gonna play again. Come on, Tiger. I'm trying to get it off that base there. Oh my, it is moving. Okay, I'm gonna take one more play. If I don't get much movement, I'm walking away. This is not worth uh, 17 plays. Not on a prize battle, where every play counts. Oh, I got it. I think I dislodged it. Oh my. I'm gonna try kind of pushing the back end. I want the prize to go forward. Oh, it's going forward. Yes! Oh no. This counts as two, a ferocious tiger and an energizing battle drink. I don't think so. <laughs> so you're saying it's a tabby sitting in a milkshake? Yes. <laughs> At least I got something. <laughs> I'm starting to think that you're letting me win on porpoise. On pur porpoise? On porpoise. <laughs> she didn't know I was going to do that one. They are dolphins. Brand new prize. And I'm going to try one on each side, so. Definitely the good tactic. I love these dolphins. I don't know how well they'll do in a, uh, a prize battle. The dolphins but are very aggressive. They yeah. attack sharks. Maybe put a laser on its head. Yeah. Oh, no. oh that one was I weak. Didn't even pick up. I really want you to win this dolphin. I, I like the dolphin. And I'm not too terribly worried about it in a uh, prize battle. I would be if I was Oh, you stabbed stabs. tail and fin. So we couldn't really tell if that claw was worth anything because we got a double stab. I definitely go for the, the bulk of the body though. All right, much cleaner. Oh, it, it had his weak sauce. Yeah. So that's uh, 13 plays. Let's go find some more stuff to win. Couldn't let it go. You had to play a big claw, didn't you? Yes. It is the giant Pac-Man ghost. Pinky, I believe, is this one's name. I think so. 
So all I got to do to nullify this ginormous prize is win a Pac-Man. Is win a Pac-Man. Yeah. So she is at the mercy of the claw on this for sure. Because just like a Gemini, you got to hope it's ready to, to pay out. Oh, what do you think? That looks pretty weak. That looks kind of weak sauce, yeah. Okay, don't waste plays. You only got about 11 I left. Know. You're going for the owl cat. Now, I will say this, we've been dying for one of these. Yes. Like neon pink or blue cats. It's on a box pusher game and somebody's already pushed it a little way. So I will say, and you're welcome to comment, I feel like this is one of your desperation ones. Like you saw an easy win. Oh! <laughs> and you know you need it at this point. Yes, I do. I applaud you for the uh, strategic so, maneuver. This is my 16th play. All right. Now, you guys will have to forgive us. If we get off a play or two, don't grill us. <laughs> what happens at the arcade? You f lose track. Ding, oh, ding, 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 ding. you got a wimpy pink cat. Hey, it still has claws. It's exactly how I feel when I see your battle pet. It is a <laughs> cat, an owl style cat, a big eyed cat. It's bright pink. I would say its battle prize rating is like a two. Hey, yours is about a one then. <laughs> oh, come on. But you won that in two and that was fantastic. <laughs> Good strategy, great win. Oh, look how cute this dinosaur is. Don't, and it's a herbivore. Don't even start. I'm a carnivore, so don't mess with me. But I'm going the for- band game. Oh yeah, this is a double win for me. I get to play the rubber band game and possibly win a dinosaur. And I believe this is play number 12? Yes, this is your 12th play. Oh! oh, that, oh, no. oh <laughs> come on now! <laughs> I mean, a win in two is fantastic, but that should have been one. And just so you know, maybe it's a herbivore, but that cat you won is a plant. It, it's <laughs> no, it's basically not. a house plant. All right. I hope this doesn't mess up somehow. Mess I've got up. that gut feeling. Come on. There it goes. Oh, there it goes. Wait, that's a pirate. That's a Arr. pirate. I, I don't know what sound a uh, herbivore makes. I now added a vicious giant dinosaur to my battle group. <laughs> you know, she's not herbivore. buying it one bit, but anyway. I needed a little bit of an edge because we are kind of even, I think. So, great win in two. It's a cute, cuddly teddy bear. No, don't even start with that. It, you can literally see the claws. This is a vicious... Those are not claws. Those are fingernails. Now, to be fair, and grizzly bears in real life are kind of cute. But that doesn't make them any less deadly. All right, so I'm playing on one of the big claws. Look how slow that's moving. I know. That's like me in the morning. <laughs> And it squeaks too, like you do. <laughs> I, I wish I could deny that. That spun like really good though. I know. Oh, that was really weak. I'm gonna try it again though, because I did, I bounced the claw off a couple balls on the bottom. All right, come on. Oh, oh and now claw. it's crooked. Okay, that's 15 for me. That claw was weak. I'm not wasting any more plays. So this is the bear that I just played for. And apparently I don't pay attention because literally, oh my, literally two machines down are these bears. Like they are legitimately more ferocious. <laughs> <laughs> and apparently she's gonna try it. I'm like you, I'm not going for the grizzly. I'm going for the polar bear. Oh, you're gonna get the polar bear. Oh, That's is that far back as it goes? I think so, yeah. All right, that may cause problems. Now, if you can get around it. Oh, that might be all right. Okay. Oh no. Roll down. Wait for it to Roll fall. Down. There, there you, you go. go. Okay. So that was play 17. She had to use one play to kind of get it into play. Luckily it rolled onto its side or you'd have been in bad shape, but it didn't look super strong, but we never know. Oh, oh. 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 All right, play 18. That held on pretty well. I think I'd play again, too. Oh. I went too far back. Oh, I don't like, know. It's got this now. What? Yeah, she bounced off this. I don't know if you can see it. 
they added a piece of glass right there, which is good if you know it's there, but we didn't know it was there. I think that's in a bad position. Are you want to waste any more plays in it, or you, what do you think you're going to do? Nope, I wouldn't either. All right, I have either a giant dog, or if you can see him tucked in there, it's Sean the Sheep hiding back there. <laughs> this one's tough. Now, the obvious battle prize would be the dog, but that's the last Sean the Sheep. We didn't even know this was here. But now I'm kind of like, I'm trying to see if I can shake one off here. No, looks like they fixed it. I'm a, pri I'm a, I'm a prize ahead of you, so I might take Sean the Sheep if I win. I'd hate to lose the, the prize battle though because I chose Sean over the dog. But sometimes you gotta sacrifice. Oh my gosh, come on. Yeah! It's Sean the Sheep. He makes a peep, he drives a Jeep, beep, 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 beep. <laughs> anyway, Sean the Sheep in one? In one, yeah. I hope I don't regret this. I am ahead a couple prizes. I'm feeling good about myself for once. <laughs> So I went with Sean. We've won one of these already. It is literally, I said in our previous video, I'm gonna put it on the mantle above the fireplace. Where does it sit? It sits on the mantle. And she was okay with that. But anyway, <laughs> I now have a Sean the Sheep added to my battle squad. She is on play 19 and she is going for the uh, dog with the Japanese bib. I guess, I'm, is it a messy dog? Is that why it needs the bib? I think so. Either that or he's ready to chow down on your prizes. <laughs> I mean, some of them I can get at this point. I hope it, I hope it picked this strong. Oh, and one! You could... Oh, oh, oh what? Yeah. A sweet win and one. I'm starting to regret taking Sean the sheep over the dog now. <laughs> he's going to eat your I, sheep. <laughs> I know, and I just told her, I was like, hey, you got five or six plays left, and you're behind. You better make it count. <laughs> She sure did. Look at that. I love it. I think we've discussed this before, but any kind of beastly, ferocious animal that brings its own snack to the battlefield is a double win. So we've got the popcorn pandas. We've got the big old beastly battle bear, and he's brought snacks. <laughs> I'm gonna have a good time eating your snacks. You bring a popcorn and a drink. Yeah, maybe you should go back and get that minion. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it is Gemini, which um, we've actually, we hit two in a row, so I'm feeling good. Seriously? Oh, okay, I'm gonna try the pink to make sure it's not ready to pay out, but that looks good. Wait a minute, I about won that and you're like, seriously? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? We're actually pretty even on prize battles, but you tend to kick my butt. Yes, I do. So, Always. what do you mean, seriously? <laughs> oh my, they both looked good. They both did good. I think the white did better, so I'm going to try one more time on the white. So, after this play, we'll both have about five plays left. So, I don't want to waste too many more plays on a Gemini, so I'm hoping this does really well. Oh, it no. bounced it into a really bad spot next to the chute in the wall. Yeah. So I guess that makes my decision for me. Let's move on. You know, I was excited when you won the pink big-eyed cat, <laughs> but now you're going for the blue one. It is on Rubber Band Game, our favorite new game. But two big-eyed cats? I think she's playing this for the, what she thinks is an easy win. And she was and right. Won. That didn't even, that wasn't even, <laughs> I don't, Go get your prize. <laughs> Big eyed cat, blue, pink, and yellow. Now remember the original rule. If you get the same prize, it nullifies and neither of them count. I know. What? <laughs> no, no. Anyway, that was a rubber band game and won. That was, yeah. man, your strategy's on point. Not so <laughs> sure about your animal choices, but hey, strategy. So close. Oh, hey girl. You like battling? <laughs> See, I'm just sitting here minding my own business to start filming. Anyway, we found something interesting. Somebody, this was not us, somebody knocked that prize off to the side. So now I have six plays left, she has four. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. I don't know if I can fix this, but 
I think it'd be fun, a fun win if I could. Basically a quick tap. I'm just gonna try to roll it in. Oh, I should've went further. Maybe. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> when people leave their messed up trash behind in the claw machines, Arcade Rising likes to take out that trash. I just, I, it's not a great battle prize, but no. for one play, I do have a seal. So my water game is tight now. Now in a prize battle situation, a shark is definitely a nine or a 10, but since it's pink, it's like a three. No. <laughs> She's going for a pink Samizu shark. And it's, it's the pastel collection, so that makes it worse. Hey. That, that wasn't bad. You got about three plays left. Now again, we've uh, seen people talking to us, we've played, we've taken breaks. If our count's a bit off, we apologize, but roughly she's got three plays left. Oh my goodness. Yes, sir. All right, you have two plays left. You gonna use both of them on this or are you gonna just I see what so. happens? Uh, she's going all in on that shark. It is picking up well. If you can just kind of get, oh. Oh, goodness. This would keep you in the game I since I have like 17 battle pets. I'm not feeling very confident about it. If, if you can get crotchage, crotch grabbage. Oh, you got crotch grabbage. No, oh, you got Gemini. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, we're not, I'm not done yet. <laughs> I still got plays. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, I don't really think that this counts as a as a battle thing. Girl, just like food nourishes your body for battle, sleep also nourishes your body and soul for battle. Oh my goodness. I'm going for a squid game pillow. <laughs> oh my, this does not count. It totally counts. We said in the very first battle, prize battle, that you can get accessories. Food, true. food magic potions, weapons, pillows. Now, I'm sure there'll be some people out there that disagree with me, but a good nap before battle, maybe after, I don't know. It, I can't see how it wouldn't do anything but help. Okay, yep. not bad. I now have five plays left. No, now that's four. That's what you I said, four now. six. No. You keep adding. <laughs> okay, so I have four plays left. I have three plays left. And I'm gonna go for that again, because I liked how that grabbed. That and I really want a nap on the way home. This is true. Such a sleepy Steve today. Oh yeah, not much sleep for me. But I don't like sleeping in the car. There's just kind of a anxiety, uncomfortableness. Let us know in comments if you guys can sleep in cars or if it just doesn't work for you. It doesn't work for me. I know you, you can sleep anywhere. This is true. Let's move one machine over. So you went for the Pac-Man and it was weak sauce, but I actually just want one of these, so. I feel good with my battle team, so if this is a bust, at least I gotta try for a prize I wanted. Dang, it took like 14 years to get over there. <laughs> so I did notice we both forgot these claws are kind of cockeyed to the right, so when they drop, they go left a couple inches. Yes. That went way far back. Oh, I know. So I'm going to go, this is my last play. And then the recruitment phase of our battle is over. Then, the, then our prizes go head to head. All right, no Pac-Man ghost. All right, we've both done 25 plays. Let's go see what we got. Are you ready to battle? No. <laughs> <laughs> no confidence, huh? Well, let's <laughs> check out your team. You've got two cats and a dog. I'm gonna call you Team Domesticated. And there doesn't seem to be any kind of theme. We got a dinosaur, a boba cat, Sean the Sheep, and a seal dress of the bear. Looks like just a bunch of riffraff to me, so we've got Team Riffraff. So if I'm being honest, I got one more prize, but 
In the grand scheme of our battle prizes, these are both kind of wimpy teams. <laughs> so there's no clear cut winner. I definitely think we need y'all's votes on this one. So make sure you guys leave in comments who you think won the battle. Who's got the tougher team if they went head to head in a battle arena? Make sure you hit that like button. Let us know what you guys think about these prize ba battle videos. We hadn't done one in quite a while. They are a blast to do, so make sure you hit that subscribe button and we will see you on the next one. Arcade Rising, out. out. It's time for a bonus claw machine. Nobody played for eggplants in the battle prize video for obvious reasons, but she really wants one and we haven't been able to win one. So she's just gonna give a few plays as a bonus. Maybe we win, maybe we don't. Oh, that didn't look bad. No, nope, not bad at all. You know, typically I wouldn't consider an eggplant a bonus. Like ice cream is a bonus. <laughs> <laughs> Candy no. is a bonus. But look at his little belly. He's I bonus. know, but it's eggplant. It's like saying, hey, if you're lucky, I'll give you an onion. Hey, some people like onions. Oh, it wants to. Oh, oh, that's good. If it, if it holds on to it for even a second, that's a yeah. win. Oh, <laughs> what, what'd you do? <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> I broke that in all kinds of ways. I could have gotten him out of there too. I was trying not to uh, stab the eggplant in his crotch. I'll all right, come to. on, I get off get of the there. Oh. oh, it's got some pickup power. This burrito would have been a bonus in real life. This one is definitely tricky. We need to get it off that chute. Oh, goodness gracious. Ay, ay, ay. You know, you gotta win this. This is bonus content at the end of a video. If you don't win it, it's just us losing at the end of a video. I know. All right, one more try. I wish it would at least bounce it into a better position. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I think it's dead. Sorry, no bonus eggplant for you. 